Today, the collaborative piece I'd like to talk to you about is by the brothers of the last nomads, Walla Paringa, Walla and Thomas. The Chappie Jerry brothers are not actually brothers, they're cousins. They were part of the group of the last nomads. This was a group of nine people that came out of the desert in 1984. There was two matriotic females, four boys and three girls. At the time they came out of the desert, Walla Paringa was 25, Thomas was 15 and Walla was 12. The boys all started painting three years after they came out. The bottom section of this painting has been done by Walla Paringa. This is a traditional uh, version of Tigger. Since coming out of the desert in 1984, Walla Paringa oversees galleries such as Key Bradley in Paris and was part of the 2012 exhibition in Documenta in Germany, where one of these paintings sold for 85,000. Walla Paringa has become the number one Papunya artist. Last year, he actually had four international exhibitions selling very well. This year, he has had two auction results, both internationally and nationally, where he's doubled his pre-estimate. On September 21 this year at Sotheby's, a 2007 painting by Walla Paringa sold for £167,000. 286,000 Australian dollars. The top left of this painting is done by Wallera. He was one of the first Aboriginal artists to uh, participate in a collaborative piece done by the Kintal men, which was done for the 2000 Olympics. This section is a modern interpretation of Tigger done in purple and white by Wallera. The right section of this painting is done by Thomas using the traditional red and white colours for the Tigger.